Uh, any prediction where we might see this in the showrooms around here anytime soon? Well, this is far from away the, uh, the concept of uh, being in a showroom, and our intent was not to do that. But it, I think many of the concepts that we're, we have prototyped and explored in this will make it into the showroom in probably uh, a couple of years' time. Great. Th thanks a lot, George, for bringing the vehicle over here today.
experts around here, your front suspension, so that's not an entirely new design, right? Um, that's, that's very old. I think it was pretty popular in the 1930s, and Porsche ran with it, I think, for 35 years before radial tires kind of made that not make so much sense. But it made sense for our design, and it's really simple, it's easy to tune, and uh, uh, it, it works well in this application. Great, very good. And that's actually a theme that we also saw in quite some of the projects we had here two years ago, that there's a lot of like a modern um, mobility concept, but some uh, more traditional um, components to it. The suspension, obviously, and the wooden parts, and also the uh, speedometer, also some of these aspects. No, it's, it's, it's a great vehicle, and um, looking forward to maybe driving it later on. How about Stanford building one? They're very inexpensive, and I'm sure you'd have a great time. <laughs> well, that, that sounds great, and you mentioned that, that you obviously want to, want to um, give it to, to high schools or universities or, or projects. Um, you should have come last week, um, where, where we had our little electric vehicle project, uh, uh, so we should look into this.